Alright, let's welcome back to Into the Breach, and uh... I guess we're gonna just make a beeline for over there, and then maybe get some power and stuff. So I defend the satellites. Uh, fuck this guy. Luckily we have a lot of damage on our side, so that's, that's all good. I mean, I like flying tanks, to be fair. Alright, so that's a problem. Alright, so I think one of the first things we should do is get rid of both these fuckers. Alright. Uh, this one I can freeze. This one I can't. So he just fires a projectile, and then what, the first thing it hits, it just hit, it just hits three things. So this guy may need to get frozen because I can't. If I swap his direction, it doesn't do anything. Well, my problem is doing it this way. My problem is I need to get rid of this guy as well. So is there? I mean, actually, I can grapple him. I might actually be much better. Oh wait, wait, this is the grapple mech. Ooh, okay. Let's reset that actually. I, I forgot which one was the grappling mech. Um, I mean actually, you know what, we probably could have done it without him. You know what, no no no, fuck, you know what, that, that was dumb of me. Because I think I can actually do it anyways. Oh no, it's not this one. It's this one. Because he's got to push. Alright, this is where we just hope this works out. Okay, it looks like it's working out pretty well. Uh, and this one we can just melee attack this thing over here. Alright, that works out pretty well. Alright, I, I, sorry, I didn't plan that out quite well and I wasted my reset. Alright, this guy's a fucking dick. Alright. Well, this guy is going to try and hit that, so we can't have that, and we can't have him hitting that either. So, let's have a look here. Hmm. I wish I could just remove this guy, but I, it looks like I really can't. No matter what, he's an issue, and he's an issue, and he's an issue. They're all issues. So... What is the best scenario for us here? Okay, let's, let's see what some of the damage order is. Five. So if I go here... Actually, wait. What order are you going? You're number one. How much damage do you do? Two. It's not enough. Okay. Also, he's going to be a problem here. This is, this Actually, this guy's a huge issue, but he can deal with it. He's actually got it. So, okay. Let's just remove him from the equation. Uh... So, we gotta deal with... Okay, they're not close enough for an, a, this anti-air strike or whatever. Yeah, we may have to accept that this one's gonna take damage. Actually, we can just freeze this thing. Maybe. I, I still need to get rid of this guy. Probably the best way of dealing dealing with that. We can just freeze this guy. There you go. So you didn't even need to take damage. Of course, there's some casualties there, but you know, that's life. All right. What order? Uh, NPC actions happens last. So. can't exactly put these guys on fire. I really hate this guy. Like, dude, more, more than you know, words cannot describe how much I hate this fucking guy. And this guy too. I hate a lot of things. Um, just trying to think here. I mean, I can easily just deal with that. Like, every turn, it's this guy has something for me to, to deal with, because he thinks he's fucking hilarious. Yeah, if I do this, then they're not gonna do anything. 
Because either, either way, it's either going to hit that or hit the rocket. So we're going to have to do something a little bit funky. Oh, right. He has to actually be in range of that. It's very unfortunate. Well, we only have two turns left, so as long as we get most of this. Right, okay, this guy has a very interesting turn, idea of a turn. Alright. And I guess you get to just end somebody. Yeah, fuck this guy. Did you all see that? So, even though it's entrapped in ice, it actually died anyways. Which is very interesting. One of those things you don't really uh, one of those things you don't really think about, but it's very interesting now. Alright, so we got artillery unit and protect the power generator. Alright. Uh, one of these guys. I mean, could always use more damage. I think I think the problem we have now is not enough AoE options. We have a lot of really great straight damage, but we don't have a lot of AoE. Alright, what happens if I move this? Well no, he's not gonna move over there. So we might just wanna... Fuck, I can't do that. Um, this guy's also an issue. We may have to punch this guy into shooting in the other direction. That's the option what it's looking right now. Or we could freeze him. Actually, we could do that. We could freeze something. See, so if, I, if I do this, then he's going to hit me and then hit the building anyway, so... Alright. I have an idea here. Look, that thing came in handy. Alright. Uh, should I start, like, just lighting up uh, objective buildings? I could just start doing that. Actually, this guy has a turn. Alright. There you go. I mean, we could just go for the achievement where we get- we use the thing a bunch of times. Alright, maybe we can't. Actually, we can. Alright, let's- let's, uh, look a little bit more at our- Why are you shooting over there? What the fuck? Dude, what's wrong with these guys? Like, dude, what are these two doing? I, I don't even know. I'm so confused. Like, I can't even put them into any, like, ideal positions. <laughs> Alright, can this guy go over here? That's the question. Yeah, he can. Uh, but why would I want that? Because if he does that, then he's going to have to shoot that guy in a bad position. Alright, can you just kill this guy? Yeah, you can. This is awkward. Alright, this guy, I don't even know what to do with him. Just, just end that guy, because that's one less annoying motherfucker that we have to deal with. I'm just gonna get the thing where I just freeze things four times. Cause it's like, dude, this looks, this is easy as hell, look at this shit. Yeah, exactly. And I guess the other guy can just, actually, actually, yeah, you can just stay there. Uh, I, yeah, I, I don't really feel the need to, I mean, I could just, you know, go over here, but. I mean, why? I, I mean, I should maybe make it so I have more options here. So yeah, I'm just gonna end up because like he may not get an opportunity to use the cryo launcher again. You never know. Ah, there now he's got the opportunity to use it. There you go, cryo expert. 
This guy gets to die. Fuck you, thing. <laughs> we didn't even use the artillery. We used it like one time and that was it. Anyways, easiest uh, achievement farming ever. Pod contents. We do not have a science class weapons. Uh, uh, well, a weapon, not weapons, weapon. Alright, we can get one more use out of that thing. Shield an ally or some health on something. I mean, health isn't that bad, but... I'm gonna get more use out of that thing, I think. You never know. Alright. Kill these seven enemies, destroy the dam, protect the robotics lab. Alright, that's uh... Pretty simple shit. Please go in the way of the dam. I I will love every single one of you if you do that. Oh, you guys are so amazing. Oh, they, dude, they cooperate so nicely with me. Look at this shit. That's so nice of them. Look at this. It's so nice of them. Alright, well, you can just fucking kill that guy, I guess. And this guy... You can just die. There you go. These guys are so nice to me. How come only one is emerging? Which is a very odd question for me to ask, but I'm gonna have to allow them to to emerge. Actually, he's flying! <laughs> Dude, the flying mechs are so cool. Alright. Oh, I got nothing else better to do. Vex surfacing, fellas. Well, I guess we might as well, um, I don't know, punch the shit out of them or something. Guess we'll start freezing and doing whatever I do. Okay, that grapple is pretty clutch, actually, but just for this. Because he's got a really powerful main gun, so. Alright, well. Actually, wait, what am I doing? Actually, I, I kind of don't want to be in the way of that, so. Oh, fuck. If I do that, then he'll die. Actually, I can do it from here. Cause he's got so much mobility to him. Alright. Definitely, if I do this on hard mode, I'm going to just do these guys' games, because these guys are so much fun. And easy. Alright. We got another reactor somewhere here. Uh, I'm gonna give it maybe to this ice mech because that gives me some options here. Although we could do the one damage. I don't like any other abilities here. I mean, the the range on this would be actually really good too. Uh, but you know, we don't have to. Cause I, I kind of want to get um, kind of want to max out my power. So speaking of which, we can do this one to try and get even more power. Because, as I said, there's an achievement for that, too. And since we're just having such a wonderful run here, we might as well fucking do it. Why not? Alright, so you're a dick. Alright. So I'm thinking about doing this. Is that a good idea, though? No, because he'll, uh, he'll attack, then. That's actually an awful idea. Could also just airstrike this. They just have a lot of HP though. Will you be set on fire? I don't think you will. I'm trying to think of the best way of dealing with this. No. They've actually found a really interesting position where I can't actually do that much but that's okay because I actually have other options here actually, what order does this happen in you're gonna just kill it actually this guy's just gonna kill that anyways all right I know I'm gonna handle this That works. Actually, that's that guy's not going to be dealt with, though. 
I gotta start blocking Vex spawns though. All right. Huh. You made a new friend, I see. Huh. Well, this guy has a lot of damage to him. All we can do is swap that guy's position here. Just try thinking. Do this. Um, he'll go last, so we can't really do that. Fuck the order of this shit. <laughs> nah, he's already acided. You could block the shot with this and then move him away. Yeah, that's probably the best idea here. And we're gonna start blocking this stuff. And there's really not much I could do here that wouldn't uh, result in me damaging my own shit. So, and I'm kind of after the power, so... Um, I guess we're just gonna wait. Oh, he's on fire too now. Highly unfortunate. Alright, let's see what we got here. So we can just kind of freeze this guy and block one of the spawns, so that's nice. This is victory in two turns. I think I have to block these. I think I have to block these two. I don't think I have a choice. Alright, this guy unfortunately is gonna be a problem. Uh, what other options do I have? Yeah, I think I have to block both of them. But the problem is that this guy's here, so how do I deal with him is the question. Do we have that airstrike thing? I do. I could just airstrike him, but... Or, no, I can't actually, because I have to be... I forgot I have to be actually seeing him. Uh, I don't think it's that important that we get, like, a perfect island. I really don't. It may not mean anything, I don't know. I don't think there's any achievements or anything for it, but I, I, I can't really manage it here without major losses, you know? It's uh, rather unfortunate we didn't get another perfect island here. It was very close though, but... Alright. So we're just gonna end this guy. He's acid and on fire, jeez. At least it doesn't amplify the fire damage. It's a bright side to everything. Alright, well we didn't get that one, but that's okay. I think it was just for three, honestly. We got the power out of it too, so I can't really complain. Uh, hopefully there wasn't some uh, PowerPoint that I didn't uh, not use or whatever, but that's okay. Uh, cores, whatever you want to call them. Alright. Uh, pretty good, good idea how I'm going to do most of this. Actually, can I just swap this guy's direction? No, I can just punch him. Hmm. If only did slightly more damage. So I wanted to artillery shell these two. And I want to deal with this guy. Which we can actually do all of that. Maybe we can just push him into the water. Goodbye. Alright. I'm just debating what to do about this fellow. Okay, now we're gonna do this. Well, I was gonna say I was gonna just, you know, do something like that, but the, the, the goose spawned right where I didn't want it to, actually, so. Right, which is now gonna make more goose. This could be an issue. Actually, looks fine. I've never been finer before. Alright, so they really want to kill this guy. Uh, Alright, so... What, who goes first? Actually, it doesn't matter, because either way, these two need to go. These these two need to go. Um, 
I mean, it might be just something as simple as doing this. I mean, he's in the way now, but that's okay. And we can just kind of knock him into the water, so, you know. Although we could have maybe saved this guy a little bit of trouble. It's gonna take a bit of damage, oh well. I don't think I've ever done a run where I feel like I'm just destroying all the goos, honestly. Like, these goos are getting wrecked. Look at this, look at this shit. We, like, we actually just completely destroyed the boss. Like, he doesn't even exist here anymore. <laughs> yeah, whatever, you're a cool kid. Oh, that's it for that. Just one off of perfect run, man. As that you got the three islands as perfect, so it's it's still okay. You know. All right, spend reputation. What do they have here? Smoke deals damage. Blast all adjacent tiles. Yeah. Is it thirty percent? Uh. I remember there was an achievement for something about that. Maybe I already got it? I thought there was one here. Someone was also telling me something about that. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's it. Progress 5, power grid earned. Uh. Oh, uh, I, you know, I, I think I don't actually really care. Maybe it's with a specific person, actually, now that I think about it. Yeah, so I don't, I don't think I really want any of these, so let's just get another power of another point here. Can I even get another grid? Yeah, I don't even know. It's okay. Don't worry about it, guys. Uh, let's see, is there anything really good here? Maybe you can get the plus one range, you know? Actually, we have this to sell. Just occurred to me. It's just worth one thing, though. There we go. Defense up 32%. Now we have plus one range on that. Not as much movement and stuff, but I mean, this is kind of neat, though. I kind of like the playstyle. Alright, let's do the final island here. Uh, we're going to start away from the volcano. I don't even know what these green tiles mean. I think it means maybe potential locations for the grid. No, it doesn't. What do the green tiles mean? Maybe I'll, uh... Maybe what I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll hover on them. No, yeah, okay, it just means nothing, actually. Literally means nothing. Can almost end these both guys. Uh... I think we can do like two damage here, but it does two damage to me as well. I think I'm actually okay with that. Oh wait, no, I'm not. No, we didn't. I, we weren't okay with that. <laughs> uh, let's see here. So we can do a crap ton of damage to him like this, but everything we have to deal with this guy. We can't just one shot. Oh wait, we can do this. Yeah, fuck this, I'm okay with that. I can just knock this guy out of the way. Oh, so we did do it. Yeah, that range did actually help out. It's like I said, like, I think the one disadvantage I was having was I didn't have enough range, everything was like a single target thing. It was really good, but it was just too much single target shit, you know? Please stay there. Oh, okay, that guy's, a, that guy's the boss. Alright. Alright, so how do we get a lot of these guys into unfavorable positions? Well, they all hate this guy, so that's okay. Alright, so I don't have to do anything about that guy. Fuck, really? I do two damage with that? <laughs> we lost. 
I guess we can start like, you know, fuck these guys. Why do, why do I even care? The, the age old question, why do I even care? Alright, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna start freezing some of these things. Alright. Hey, did volcanoes get rid of mountains? Alright, that doesn't seem right. Ah, uh, dear old Scions. Dear old these things too. I think I want to get rid of him. For reasons that should be obvious, he annoys me. Alright, now we only have to deal with one of them. Because we've just blocked every other thing from spawning. Actually, no, we haven't. We could have pushed him onto that tile, actually. Could have, would have, should have. I didn't see it because of the fire. Oh well. I like. I don't think we honestly really care. All right. So you're on fire. So what the hell are you gonna do? Hold on. All right. I mean, it's just kind of how it goes. Oh right, right. Of course, you can't actually do anything. He can't heal. So he's to chillax. You know, he might repair really well with that ability that someone gets to fully repair all mechs. Or like like uh, the, the item that you get for that. Uh, that might be really good. Just saying. I wouldn't even say this was like my luckiest run ever. I just think these guys are really strong. Like, they just do a lot of damage. I mean, it, I, the Mantis really helped though. Like, the Mantis paired so well with the other one, because it's like, you can freeze or you can do some other stuff, so it's great. Alright. Yeah, 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 we got the right field bump. A bump and Alright. Alright, well... We got some issues here. What I might end up doing is moving the bomb. Just trying to think here. You go first, right? Alright, I think I know how I'm going to do this. Uh... Alright. You go first and do two da two damage. Uh, that's not enough damage. What the fuck? When did when did you do such pathetic damage? Actually, fuck. I was gonna have him like one hit everything in the line here. I was gonna pull them all in and shit like that. Yeah, it looks like that's not working. I'm very sad about this. Believe me. Oh, I could still do something somewhere though. I think. We just have to make sure that this guy moves as well. Except he's like, it's fucking useless because he's not doing any damage then. Fucking hell. I hate this game so much. Alright. Now they're all worthless. Except for spawning more things, but whatever. That's sometimes how it goes. Alright. So what's on this tile? Tentacles, it will turn into lava. Alright, so we got, we have some lava tiles. So, moving this guy onto those tiles would probably be a good idea. I don't know what we have for that. Might be one of the other flaws of this guy. I mean, we could just freeze him, honestly. I'm actually okay with that. We do, we do have to deal with all these guys, though. Alright, so it's this guy, this guy, and this guy that are all the problem. This guy can be frozen. The unit here will die, and it will turn into lava, so yeah. We have to make sure that he doesn't die. 
could also pull him over to kill something else. Uh, two damage. I think of also pulling him out of the way, like I said. But yeah. It's not looking likely. I don't think I can even end most of these guys. Which is weird because I, I was saying before how much I was bragging before about how much damage I had. But I really don't now, do I? Alright. What kind of options do we have for swapping their posi their uh Oh my god. We're gonna take so much damage actually. That's actually this is so weird. Like like this, every single tentacle went, went onto my tiles, which I think is what it normally does anyways. Because this guy is going to hit two tiles, and he's going to also hit that one, right? This guy's going to hit over here, this guy's going to hit over here. This is actually one of the first times that they, they're not actually targeting just me down, they're targeting like everything. And uh, that's, that's the other disadvantage I have here, is I don't have a lot of stuff to push people around. Unless they're like in a line. So maybe what we'll do is like... Now I want to freeze this guy, didn't I? I don't know. I'm thinking of doing it the other way, actually. Yeah, we're, we're gonna need to freeze this guy, I think, is one of the only plays we can make here. We're gonna have to freeze him. And I don't really know what we're gonna have to do about this guy. I think I can just stand in here and maybe get both of these. Like, move one guy out of the way. I think we're just gonna have to accept that we're in some trouble. Uh, okay, we're we're in like some super trouble, actually. Because I'm, I'm starting to realize I can't even actually kill a lot of these guys. I mean, I, I mean, I guess this could have gone slightly better, but I don't like this. Dude, we're gonna like die in like one turn. Like this is three damage, this is two damage. What the fuck? Yeah, cause we're gonna lose all of that. Okay, let's, let's, okay, let's, let's, let's update our, our objectives. We're gonna just accept that one of them is going to go. So what we should do is actually ignore this guy, ignore this guy. Get rid of this guy, get rid of this guy, and get rid of this guy. Like, like, just make sure they don't attack. So, like, fine, they're gonna fuck on this one. It's just one. Like, like, I think at this point, we've, we're gonna accept the fact that this one's just dead. So, let's just do that, then. So, we just need to remove this guy and remove this guy, then. I mean, that seems simple enough. I wish I had more options for this guy. Actually, I do. What the fuck? Oh no, he's gonna die now. Oh fuck. And I can't remove him now. Uh. Yeah. Shit. I, if I only I went to the other tile, fuck. Alright. Uh, plan B. I think we're gonna try and save him. <laughs> I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna bring him off the tile. Fuck this shit. I gotta save him. I I gotta save him, guys. All right, that's three damage. How much damage does this guy do? Three, whatever. Pick your poison, guys. All right, whatever. I took a bit of damage. All right, that I made a mistake. I made a slight error. Well, this is where we hope and pray that we get the uh, the procs now. Yeah, we we don't care about that proc. No shit. All right. Mistakes may have been made there, because then I had to waste my turn in saving that guy. Alright, this guy's an annoying piece of shit. Um, that's always great. This guy is an annoying piece of shit too. So this guy is really not doing anything at all. Uh huh. How much damage is he gonna do? One damage. That's actually really not a big deal to me, honestly. Alright, well, the rocks are gonna fall here, so I'm thinking that we just allow him that to take place. We still need to deal with this guy somehow. I mean, we could just knock him back a tile instead. Alright, here, uh, actually, no, 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 that's not the one. Uh... Actually, no, because I'm gonna die if I do that. Actually, we can... no, we can't do anything with him. 
That's uh, rather irritating. Because I, I can't really do anything about that guy. And one of these guys is going to go. So, okay, there's only three things hitting stuff. So I should, in theory, be able to find a way to make it so that the three don't do anything. But the, the problem is this, the problem is actually this guy right here. This guy is actually the issue. But we do have an artillery cannon, but the artillery cannon I don't think is going to do anything. Alright, I think I have the play. We're going to freeze this thing. Uh, kill this guy, and kill this guy. So, can this guy deal with him? Kind of can if he does this. Alright, we do this, push him onto that tile, and this guy, whoops, will freeze that tile. Alright, so that works out actually. The scion isn't a big deal. We can we can live through the scion. It's kind of weird how it works out. Also, why did he take additional damage? Oh, because the scion broke him out. Huh. Kind of would like to save him. Not gonna lie. Actually, all I have to do is uh, free something and not take damage. So that's good. Victory in one turn. Alright, so there's gonna be. You know, here will die and turn into lava. Well, I mean, he can't really do anything there. So, let's have a plan. Yeah, so we can't just have that thing die. Alright, so I'm thinking we just freeze that thing right here. Probably a good way of doing that. Uh, this one's pretty simple. We just, uh, reverse his direction. And the last thing here is we push these guys around. Sign will do damage again, but it won't kill anything. The sign was super annoying this round, I won't, I won't lie. Alright, well we did it. It was close. It was a little bit close. It was not like you take the energy with you, it's just we won the timeline, so... Yeah, the f like, they, they didn't seem to have any flaws until near the end where I was having issues hitting multiple things, because a, a lot of the stuff is, oh, you can ma manipulate things by turning them against each other. The guy who flips things around just kills things most of the time, you know? Doesn't do anything else. But it was, it, they were still super cool. I've learned a lot from that one, though. I like them. They're really good. I think they're my favorite so far, which is kind of weird to say, but yeah, definitely my favorite. Fuck yeah. All right, so thanks to the valiant ve uh, efforts of Henry Kwan, Prospero, and Kazobek, we're taking him with us. Like, I don't give a fuck. It's too adorable not to take with us. All right. So the last one we have, do I have enough? Ah, I just have enough coins to do it. Buy secret squad, 25 fucking coins. You gotta be shitting me. <laughs> well, I may not be doing that one for a while, because uh, that one's, um, I don't know, I'll see if I can unlock it uh, like through some other means. There's also like random squad, which I've kind of seen what random squad does. I'll show you in a sec, but yeah. I, I still want to do every mech here. So we got leap to a tile, damaging adjacent tiles and itself. All right. That's kind of neat. Brute force weapon. Holy shit. Is that all these guys do? Is they just damage each other? Oh my god. Heal 10 mech health in a single battle. Does he get like... Oh, they they, they, they heal themselves when they deal a killing blow, so that's kind of good. Fucking hell, though. Alright, what was I going to show you guys? Oh yeah, I was going to show you guys random squad what that does. Alright, you see what I mean? You can do Chaos Roll, which is purely randomized squad, no restrictions on weaponry, or mech, or anything like that, so... You know, you get like a flamethrower guy, a leaping mech, and a fucking... Like, punching mech. See? See what I mean? Then Balance makes it so that, um... All mechs will be unique and not have the same class. Mechs have no more than four weapons between them. So... You get like Bash, you get the Ice. This is like most of the Ice one, honestly. Uh, and charge, and st Attraction Pulse, and the shitty-ass lighting mech. Things like that. So I don't know, I don't think we're going to do any random squads. Maybe we will, I don't know. I'll see. Uh, but yeah, that, that requires a lot of coins for that, so I, I would prefer to get that through, like, 
some unlock online that I can find, maybe? I don't know. I will look into that, but... I mean, we got this stuff all manually. I just didn't expect that the Secret Squad would require coinage. It means you have to do most of these achievements. And I hate the Blitzkrieg mech, so... Uh, well, because I definitely wouldn't be doing that in this amount of time, so... Uh, not, not for, like, next time, so... Anyways, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and take care. Goodbye.